a video by Black Unicorn Fan Fictions. Kindly do not copy and read the disclaimer carefully. I am getting ready for a shopping date. Today, I will shop for my wedding with my fiancé. We are having an arranged marriage. His father is our family friend. What's up, parrot? She is wearing a green colored dress. Going on a date? With whom? Why did you forget that I am not single anymore? I am going for my wedding shopping with my dashing fiancé. Dashing, there is a problem with your dictionary. Learn the difference between dashing and horrible. You are just jealous, single peaches. His nose is bigger than our wash basin. Big nose, do you know what it means? He will block all your oxygen while he stop it. I don't want to imagine this. He must need a chimta to clean his nose. Yunji, please don't talk like this. I start laughing on your silly jokes in front of him and he thinks I am mentally disturbed. Oh, I thought he's an idiot. But he can judge a person nicely. How am I looking? Wait, I need to wash my eyes. I'm leaving. I'm sitting in his office from last two hours. He said that he has to attend an important meeting. I'm getting frustrated. Why didn't he tell me before? Ma'am, sir said that he won't be able to meet you today. You should go back. What the? Why didn't he tell me before? I'm sitting here from last two hours. I am sorry, but where is he? You can't go there. He's working. I want to meet him right now. I caught up and started walking towards CEO's office room. I entered in his office. He's sniffing some files. I started barking on him. Are you insane? Why do you think that everyone is free except you? I wasted my two hours while waiting for you and now you ask me to leave? Do you have some sense of responsibility? Is this how you're gonna treat me after marriage? He kept on looking at me with anger while clenching his jaw. Suddenly, he looked someone behind me. I'm sorry, sir. Excuse me. He held Wyan's hand and started dragging her out. He apologized to a man sitting on the couch. I didn't notice him. Jake held my hand and dragged me outside. Stop it, you're hurting me. What do you think you are doing? Is it too hard for you to understand that I am busy? He took out his card and threw it at her. Take this and leave. Stop bothering me. She threw it back on his face. What made you think that I am here to ask for money? I never thought you will be so cheap. I can afford to buy. Oh, forget it. We are done. Buy a chimta to clean this dusty nose of yours. No one can breathe properly while standing near you. She left. Mr. Choi? Oh, I'm sorry, sir. She is my fiancé. Was, I guess. No, um, uh, actually she... Well, I don't want to interfere in your personal matters. I want to say that I like your idea of new project, but we can't collaborate with you. Just because of your behavior with your fiancé, I don't think you are capable of handling big deals and responsibilities. Sorry. He humiliated me. I will not marry him. Why, Anne? We can't step back now. Then kill her. Why do you care about society more than your own child? I have talked to Mr. Choi. He will scold Jake. What is he? A child studying in kindergarten? He is a grown-up man. If he can humiliate her in front of many people, what is he gonna do with her behind the doors? I understand what you are saying, but no buts, mom. You are crossing the limits. It proves that you don't care about her at all. She brought a knife from the kitchen and kept it on Wyan's wrist. Let her die. What the hell is she doing? No, 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 no. Don't stop her, mom. No one loves her. No, Wyan, wait. You prove that she's unplanned and unwanted. Not her drama again. But let me just play alone. I don't want to live anymore. Why and end the shit? Okay, okay. We will cancel the wedding. Nothing is more important than my child's happiness. Let me inform them. Thank God we saw his true face before marriage. It was a busy day. I'm going to sleep. I am happily working in my office. Jake apologized to me but my parents called off the wedding. Wyan, yesterday's report. It's here, sir. Good. Send it to GM's room. All right. She left. Good morning, sir. Oh, Wyan. Yesterday's meeting reports. Mail it to me. Why did I come so far? All right. I didn't ask you to leave. Sorry. Our new branch needs some experienced and well-qualified employees. We are thinking to send some staff from here rather than hiring new one. So I think you should...
make a list i what make a list of employees who deserves promotion fake the smile sure sir hum please get me a cup of coffee one more thing that branch will be handled by rock industries so they have requirement all females should be married on upper level of management and why is that well i don't know much about it maybe because md of rock industries is a handsome bachelor and he doesn't want unnecessary headache by the way i heard that you are also getting married put your name also in the list yeah thank you here i am my salary is almost double got a personal office got promotion everyone thinks that i'm married i didn't tell them that i already called off my wedding well my bank account is happy who cares about anything else also i'm not interested in that md or bd i will keep doing hard work and won't hit on md so i guess there is no problem in telling lies about my marriage tell status miss wyan you need to report in md's office all right i entered in the room and got shocked to see md he is the same man who was sitting in jake's office that day hope he doesn't know anything good morning sir i started sweating if i'm not wrong you came from nithalle corporations y- yes he smirked and stood in front of me i think we have mentioned that only married employees will be accepted in this work area yeah i am married show me your marriage certificate well i i think he knows everything he came closer to me but i didn't step back i know that you aren't married that condition was useless i'm very professional i can assure you that you won't feel any trouble because of me hmm these were company's rules not mine in last few years many female employees started hitting on male superiors to get promotion that's why company made this rule it shouldn't be limited to women only hmm it's not it's for both oh maybe i got half information will it change the fact that you lied i am sorry do you know what will happen if everyone will got to know about it company will take actions against me for fraud i think it's a bit too much it it is what it is but you won't expose me what made you think like that if you wanted to you could have fired me till now observing your actions and this calmness on your face i can sense that you won't take actions against me i won't but you want something in return yes i came from a respectful background glad to hear that me too so how can i help you as i said everyone on the top level of management should be married i also work on one of its posts there is a ring on your finger but i am unmarried i also thought this rule is baseless and stupid for me so i also decided to tell lies and now my senior has a doubt that i am unmarried he visited my house last week how can i help you let's get married on papers not a good idea do you have another option or idea um no let's have a contract for a year we will live together none of us can date someone else where did i trap myself into greed is dangerous i need some time to think about it you have 24 hours sign this contract this will be a real marriage according to our family and friends we can think about excuse of divorce later what if you will fall for me i like this confidence if something like this will happen we will confess to each other and should think of giving a chance to this marriage let's have a small wedding hmm i will come to your house today with my parents